I got given gym clearance. Well, that's okay. All you can see is kids. I just went to the gym. And I'm gonna do my makeup. So I have just been to the gym. I've done my makeup. I'm ready to venture into the outside world. As soon as you can it. Does it matter that you can see my tits? I don't think it does. Don't let me drown. Most people are like, oh, you can't do that, you can't grow up looking like that. Well, I am. Not in this jacket though, because it fucking stinks. If you guys can't tell, I'm having a bit of a happy day. I've finished the doctor. So today I'm not going out, I think. I don't even know if I believe or not, because of yesterday. I only explained yesterday. Basically yesterday was not a good day, in case you didn't know. Um, yeah, I need my towels. I kind of irritated the water manager a little bit. But I the fact that I've ruined so many towels in my hair, I just need to get new hair dye, because I want to. We have the human bath. Hey. And we have a future plan. Yes, we do, big one. Do we reveal it now or then? Later. Oh. The person doing meds tonight is such a bitch. Like, fuck me. I, I, I was just trying to be nice. I was like, oh, hey, at least I'm feeling better, feeling better today. She was like, oh, well, here you go. Here's your Lorraine's palm. Here's your Zoppy loan things I usually have to help me sleep. And I was like, oh, can I have 25 milligrams of promethazine because it helps me. And she was doing it and she stopped doing it and I was, I didn't know what, I, I thought maybe she was going to give me after. And she's like, oh, you could make up your mind that again, tell me if you want to, oh, like, fucking, fuck you. My outfit of the day. Pink. <laughs> Very pink. Someone asked me earlier in this video uh, what plan of action was. I didn't know because I had no word around. I've had my word right now and basically in two weeks I should be getting discharged. Two weeks to discharge and I'm so happy but this shit all needs to be made to look a bit better so I go shopping later. I just did some shopping to see if I can get back on my own store. Or if I'm actually use my debit card. Good morning guys, I've just been given weekend leave, meaning pack as much shit as I can, go home for the weekend, then get discharged. Big deal. Yesterday I filmed like a night routine, today I'm filming me packing for home leave, slash aka they need a bed and I am the most suitable candidate to be discharged. I'm actually pretty much, I'm actually pretty much packed up everything now. I'm basically ready to go. I'm ready to Rina. Rina has given me a huge, huge hand in taking my stuff back to mine because, believe it or not, I've accumulated quite a lot of stuff while I've been here. So it does feel really weird packing to leave. It's a nice feeling though, I'm not gonna lie. I'm actually very happy to be at home. <laughs> but I do have to park because I'm moving this weekend. <laughs> oh, that's a good fun. I need to keep that. That's an important notebook. I stay there. I shoes are that. Planned. That's it. Packed. After two months of being impatient, it's finally over. <laughs> I finally get to get my life back and that means so much to me. This is how much stuff I accumulated while I've been here. It's while we're looking around like it's all empty. I'm going home. It's a weird concept. I must be moving this weekend. One thing I want you to learn from my channel is to don't just don't be afraid to ask for help that's the ultimate message in my channel hashtag discharged um i did manage to lose my makeup though which is uh mildly irritated me um 
yeah, I'd like to thank everyone for their support throughout the last few months. Like, while I've been impatient, while I've been probably not the best YouTuber to follow. Like, because I'm so honest and I share, like, my thoughts and everything, it's probably not been the best channel to watch, follow, and no, subscribe to, but you guys have supported me through it. And I want you to know that I am working on a few things to hopefully support you guys back. And I genuinely, genuinely, genuinely want to say thank you because I've also had to deal with my fair share of hate while I've been in hospital. Because people are like, oh, yeah, you shouldn't use the new phone, you should be focusing on this, and blah blah blah. And you guys stood up for me, you guys stood by my side, and I couldn't have asked for more. Like, thank you.